Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Adam. This is HML4 Gaming. Welcoming you to 13 Sentinels, Aegis Rim. Before we get into it, this is an Atlas game. Um, it just came out a few weeks ago. It's made by the fine folks over there at VanillaWare. Um, you may be familiar with some of their games as uh, Dragon's Crown and other the like. Um, so what's about this game? I really don't know much about this game. I saw it was coming out. I know Atlas usually puts out great games. If I'm just looking at the, you know, the stuff that I see online, it is divided between action side-scrolling segments and real-time strategy battles and follows 13 high school students in a fictional 1980s Japan who are dragged into a fictional war between mechs and hostile kaiju in a non-linear narrative. So, I saw kaijus and mechs and I was immediately hooked. Without further ado, let's get into it. Oh, we just get right into the music right there. Um, I think for this we'll go with English. Maybe we'll switch them back and forth. We interrupt this program to bring you an important emergency broadcast. A large unidentified object has crash landed in the city. It is headed north toward Kasumicho, destroying everything in its path. A state of emergency has been declared in Ashitaba City. The neighboring three wards are advised to evacuate immediately. Please defer to the police for further instructions. Be advised that the express lanes are currently out of service. Roads are expected to face heavy congestion. Proceed with caution. Use 
set to neutralize the D forces in front of you. I don't know if I'm doing this right, but how's this? All right, so we're straight into the action. So tutorial attack. To control your pilot, move the cursor over a pilot and select A. Once the menu opens, press X to select action and destroy the enemy using arm mounted machine cannons. Okay, so I guess I select. Worker, 150 HP. Small crawling kaiju equipped with a low output beam gun. Though it may be the weakest among the kaiju, it's still 8mm in length and a major threat to humans. Moves in packs and has low durability. Area attacks are effective. Skills, excavator beam. Okay, can I fire? How do I fire? Oh, there we go. Action. Light mounted machine gun. Attack kaiju within target area in front of the sentinel with machine cannons. Fire. Alright. Oh, there's an area effect. Slow down. Different combat situations might call for different weapons. All concentrated in one area. You could use a wide impact armament like the rocket launchers. What? What? Uh, okay. Rocket launchers? Oh, where's the rocket launcher button? Check your display. The rig is on your shoulders. Focus on them. My shoulders? Is this how I do it? Select action, destroy the enemies using multi rocket launcher. Adjust the attack range with the left stick to target as many enemies as possible. Focus. Okay. Yeah, right in the middle sounds good. Fire multiple rockets into target area. Stand by ion control. Fire. There we go. Took them all out. Look at this space invader guy looking dude. Number 15's taken damage to the rear exhaust system. Uh oh. Sentinel number 13. Activated. Another sentinel's been transmitted behind you, Fuyasaka Kun. But who is it? This is Sentinel number 13. Moving to cover Fuyasaka-san. Karabe, what are you doing here? I can't let this turn out like Sector 3. Izumi? No. There's no way his memory could have returned. I remember doing this in my dreams. I think I can do this. Wait until we call for backup, Izumi. My name is Juro Karabe. Select action and select heavy knuckles. Use the left stick to attack the enemy in front of you while moving around. So this is a G molar, 1600 attack, not attack, HP. Heavily armored kaiju that specializes in close combat at 35 millimeters. Well, meters. It possesses both massive weight and power range attacks such as rapid fire guns. Aren't very effective. It's best to take it down with close quarters attacks. Skill, headbutt. Obviously, look at that big ass guy. Can I move? So heavy knuckles, attack. Oh, look at that one shot. Victory! That was a nice tutorial fight. We damaged 1% of the city, apparently. Joro Karabe? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Story of Joro Karabe. This again? What is going on? 
Come on, Jiro. Let's go home. Shiba-kun. Basic controls. Use the left stick to move and press X to talk to people. Sayuda Shiba. What's up with you? I just get this weird feeling sometimes. Like something's off. What the? Going to school, living my life. It's like I'm not supposed to be here. You've seen too many movies, man. Thought Cloud. Sometimes when you learn about a specific person or thing, it'll be added as a keyword. Press triangle to open the thought cloud and select the comp comp contemplate keyword. Shirabe has been added to thought cloud. She becomes Consider. a bit of a class clown, but he's a good friend. I always talk to him about action flicks. Oh, I just phase through people. <laughs> Anything Speaking else? Movies. I brought your video back. Thanks for letting me borrow it. Already? I just lent it to you yesterday. You wasted no time. Can you blame me? Giant robots, fights in the city? I was on the edge of my seat. <laughs> you sure love Mecha, don't you, Jiro? Videotape has been added to the Thought Cloud. Thought Cloud, some keywords can be used on other characters. When this option is available, press square, tr square, triangle, and it will appear above your head. Videotape. Here you go. Let me know if you have any others to recommend. Damn, VHS. Sure, yeah. You really turned into a movie buff, huh? <laughs> Do you think it's too much? Well, now that you mention it, I've been seeing this stuff in my dreams, too. Yep, definite movie addiction. You're showing all the signs. Soon enough, you won't know the difference between fiction and reality. Yeah, yeah. I think I've seen a movie about that. Hold circle to move faster. Lori Fawakasa, the girl that we just saw. Fuyusaka-san. Should I wake her up? I'll eventually get these names right. Come to think of it. In that movie yesterday, the girl piloting the robot looked awfully familiar. Can we wake her up? I guess hey, not. By the way, I saw that one video up for rent. Oh, the one you told me about the other day? Really? Yep. Gonna rent it. I've got to. Oh, crap. Give me a minute. I'll be right back. Okay. It's always something, isn't it? Guess I'll wait here. Wonder what he's up to. Shall we go home, Asami chan? Uh, sorry. I've got plans with someone. Let me guess. It's Nandi kun right? Ew, no. I mean, it is a guy, but Yuri chan met someone special too. I'm the only one left. You're all so lucky with boys. It's not fair. Deep breaths, Miwako. Hold on a sec, Miwako. Did you need something? <laughs> Don't mind me, I was just eavesdropping. So as I was saying... Hey, Fuyusaka-san. Rise and shine. Uh, huh? Class is already over. Kurabe-kun? Um... Thanks. You were out cold, huh? Just now, I... I had another weird dream. And you were there. Huh? Me? What kind of dream was it? Well, um... Dude! Huh? This sucks, man. You can't find Amiguchi anywhere. Wait a minute, what's going on here? You two are looking awfully cozy. It's not like that. Hmm? Oh yeah? Then what's the problem? <laughs> Don't mind me. 
Carry on. <sighs> Sorry. Oh, we got really up. close. Let's talk about this some other time. <sighs> yeah. I'm going home now. Okay. See you tomorrow. What? I know I shouldn't tease you like that. But it's your fault for keeping too. secrets from me. <sighs> Can I talk to you guys? Hey. No. No. Oh, yes, I can. Oh. Sorry. No, nope, can't really Seriously. talk to her. Amiguchi. We've got to catch that guy in quick. You want to hang out again that badly? He's got all the good video games. You're just waiting for me to play him. But the sucky thing is, he's never around unless you make plans. They're really supporting one another. Oh my god. Maybe I should join a club too. Can I talk to you? No. You're messing with my conversation it's with my boy over here. Go oh, yes, go home. You are interrupting the boys over here. You know, Amiguchi-kun usually grabs a snack on his way out. Maybe he's still around. Oh, in the cafeteria? That's right. He was there during break, too. Let's head to the cafeteria. Grab your stuff and come on. Uh, oh, now you want to talk to me. Hello. What is it, Sawatari-san? Those papers on the podium. Could you take them to Miss Morimura in the nurse's office? Me? Oh, well, it's your turn this week. Oh, is it? Okay. The papers are on the podium. Okay, the nurse's office. Is this it? Y yes, that's right. Please take care of it. A stack of papers has been added to the thought cloud. Oh, okay. Can I go to the nervous office, Kaitu, before we uh, go somewhere? Grab your stuff and come on. Um, about that. Sorry, I can't. These papers. I need to take them to Miss Morimura. Seriously? I'll do what you gotta do. But we're not giving up on Amiguchi, all right? I'm gonna head over to the cafeteria. Grab your bag and meet me there when you can. Where is my bag? Is this my bag? Yep. Additional controls. Hold R1 to move fast forward text. Fast forward will automatically pause any unread text and press this touchpad to view the text log. Press options to open the pause menu and select manual to view controls. Okay. I like how it does that. That movie's a hidden gem. It's tough to get a hold of these days. She always seems to be sleeping. <laughs> it's odd. And then she shows up in my dreams. I can't help but be a little curious about her. <laughs> you don't say. Shibakun's a bit of a class clown, but he's a good friend. I always talk to him about action flicks. Amiguchi-kun's not the most responsible guy, but he's smart, athletic, and popular with the ladies. On top of that, his family is rich. He's got all the latest video game consoles in his room. I mean, it doesn't necessarily mean you're rich. Alright, and before we move on, I think uh, that'll be a good spot to wrap it up. I just wanted to try this out for today, and let me know if you want to see um, this in the future. Continue it onward, we'll see how it is. Um, it's in very interesting, I like narrative-driven games, and I like the turn-based tactical stuff with the mechs. And I'm very interested to see where all this turns out, because, I mean, there's talks of time travel, kaiju, mechs... I mean, what else could you want? It's an Atlas game, Vanillaware... So uh, we're definitely, definitely going to be taking a look at this.
but I hope you can enjoy but I hope you can join me next time. Again, I have been Adam, this has been HMO4 Gaming, and this has been the very interesting 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. Thank you very much. Have a great night.